Welcome to my rant. Uh, look, I've come recently to the realization that mostly that I vlog and I do these videos because I don't really freaking have anybody to talk to. Uh, I work at home with a 12 and a 13 year old who just don't give a crap about mom struggles. My husband works shifts. He's rarely home when I'm home uh, to rant. For the past five or six weeks, I have been using Dylan's pickup service here. Dylan's in Lovemore, Kansas is a grocery store. And they offer free pickup service. Somebody in there does all the little shopping for you and then they load it into your car and you're on your little merry way. So today I decided I need to go into Dylan's. There is a meat sale and I wanted to pick out certain roasts and every time that I've been here there's been several items that they can't find. So I've been, you know, compiling a list of those and if I haven't stopped to get them like at the pharmacy or whatever then I, you know, I need to get them here. I continually was putting them on my list. Some of these things include like Tide Pods and certain body soaps and um, certain varieties of rice, um, for examples. I thought, no big deal. I'm here early on a Saturday morning. The parking lot isn't very busy. I mean, you can see there's lots of parking behind me. I'm about third row over, third parking spot up. Not a bad deal. There's a man over there watching me vlog. Are you a subscriber? I will shout you out. Just come on over. It's like, hey, Cassie. I'll be like, be in my vlog. Okay, I digress. Listen. <sighs> that place was busy. Here's another negative against grocery pickup. Uh, Dylan's has moved a lot of things around since the last time that I was in there. Now, I did go in there to get stuff for camping a couple of weekends ago, but actually it just went to like the snack aisle and a chip aisle in the pop tart aisle <laughs> just to get junk for the kids things that have been moved around is the bakery section and the fruits and veggies where things used to be there are no more and that might just be the universe trying to tell me to eat organic because i went down to go get my peppers and i'm like how come there's only like five peppers yellow peppers like hello um, yeah, I was in the organic pepper section. Uh, and there was a nice, wonderful employee stocking the main pepper section, which was way at the other end of the produce area. And there are people everywhere. Everybody in there is wearing their mask. Everybody's, you know, trying to remain as socially distant as they can. <sighs> it was just, it was, it was busier than the parking lot revealed. There are lots of pluses to grocery pickup that I realize now, having been in there getting a week's worth of groceries. One really good thing about grocery pickup is I don't have to deal with those crowds. Those employees are in there with their big carts and their crates and they're just zooming up and down the aisles. Um, for the most part, I think most of them know where things are. They're um, like the Italian bread. Nobody can ever find that. It's in the bakery section. It's on a low shelf. It's a dollar a loaf right now. I have been, we've, we've been gone, gone without Italian bread for weeks. I know. I don't need your pity. Um, also, um, because somebody else is in there shopping, I'm not in there sweating and bumping into carts and trying to figure out where the hell things are because they moved them. And I also like grocery pickup because they load it in your car for you. I hate doing that. I hate it's all bagged up. I had to bag today. Like they're short staffed. When I got up into the line, there was one register open. While I was standing in line, they opened up two more. Of course, I let the people in front of me go. That's the right American thing to do. But with those two registers opening, my cashier lost her bagger. And uh, I mean, it's on the floor too. Another thing about the grocery pickup and shopping my list on the app is that I don't spend as much money. 
Um, now, granted, I just keep redefending myself here. Today, I decided uh, we're gonna get rid of the fruit that's in the house. It's been in there for a couple of weeks. Just gonna put it out in the compost and. Um, so I did restock up on apples and oranges and bananas. I bought a big bag of broccoli and cauliflower and some spinach and onions, peppers, which I got last. Um, it, it, it added up quick. Also, I needed dog food, body soap, laundry detergent, dishwashing detergent, paper towels. You know, that stuff's all like 10 bucks a piece. But when I'm doing grocery pickup, I always seem to spend about 120 bucks. Today I spent 220 bucks. I think it all is gonna come out in the wash because now I don't have to go to Walmart or run by a pharmacy for some of those things. Sometimes on grocery pickup, they'll text you and they'll be like, you know, we can't give you this product. We can't even substitute for it. I just wanna text them back and be like, uh, it's an aisle three. It's by the bottled water. I know it's a weird place for it, but it's in a basket down the cleaning aisle. You know, I just want to be like, I know where these things are. Maybe I should just, no, I'm not getting a job there. I'm not personal shopping. I don't even like shopping for myself. I don't like sweating. Of course, if I got paid for it. No, it's only like 10 bucks an hour to work here. So if that, I'm going to keep using the pickup. It's free. Um, and things that they can't find, maybe I'll just park my car and go in and get them. Because running in for a few things is just, is a lot easier. And I can use self-checkout, which I hate those. That's a rant for another time. Um, but for just a few things. I don't have to stand in line and wait. I don't have my mask on for a hundred years. And my glasses fogging up or falling off about my face. And I'm just bitching moaning I'm just over I know everybody is everybody's over this okay like three people just pulled up dating us so I need to go listen thanks for listening to me moaning rant what do you prefer in your like town do you like to do pickup or delivery delivery's 10 bucks screw that I don't need to be coming to my house but dog's a jerk anyway anyways I gotta go say hi to my friend so take care talk to you soon bye